بتاریخ اکتیس ڈسمبر کو ایم مہندر ریڈی تلنگانہ کے ڈی جی پی کی حیثیت سے ریٹائرڈ ہو گئے تلنگانہ پولیس اکیڈمی میں ڈی جی پی مہندر ریڈی کی ریٹائرمنٹ پریٹ کا شانداری نے خات کیا گیا ڈی جی پی ایم مہندر ریڈی کی ریٹائرمنٹ پریٹ تلنگانہ پولیس اکیڈمی میں منعقد کی گئی اس پروگرام میں پولیس حکام اور دیگر وی آئی پیز نے شرکت کی اس موقع پر مہندر ریڈی نے پولیس کی سلامی لی بعد ازا ایم مہندر ریڈی نے سی ایم کے سی آر کا شکریہ ادا کیا انہوں نے کہا کہ سی ایم کے سی آر تلنگانہ میں ویژنری قیادت فرام کر رہے ہیں مہندر ریڈی نے جدید فرینڈلی پولیسنگ میں تاؤن کرنے پر انہیں پانچ سال تک ڈی جی پی کے طور پر خدمات انجام دینے کا موقع فراہم کرنے پر بھی شکریہ ادا کیا ایم مہندر ریڈی نے چھتیس سال تک بطور آئی پی ایس آفیسر کے طور پر خدمات انجام دیے تلنگانہ پولیس کے ڈی جی پی حیدرآباد سی پی اور کئی اہم عہدوں پر بھی فائز رہے انہوں نے مائع ازم کے کنٹرول کے لیے بہت سارے اچھے کام کیے تکنیکی طور پر مہندر ریڈی نے محکمہ پولیس میں انقلابی تبدیلیاں لائی ہے تو وہیں دوسری جانب انجنی کمار آئی پی ایس تلنگانہ کے نئے ڈی جی پی کے طور پر چارج سنبھالیں گے اس کے علاوہ ڈی ایس چوہان نریڈمنٹ آفیس میں رچا کنڈا سی پی کے طور پر چارج سنبھالیں گے آئیے دیکھتے ہیں اس خصوص میں وہاں کے چند مناظر پیش ہے سینئر رپورٹر شیخ احمد کی ایشین ٹی وی نیوز کے لیے یہ خصوصی رپورٹ All the seniors present here, former director generals and other senior officers with their respective family, my dear colleague officers, ladies and gentlemen, greetings to all of you. First of all, I take this opportunity to sincerely express my gratitude to the Honorable Chief Minister, sir, for bestowing upon me such a big responsibility which I shall be sharing with each one of you. The star of Telangana has to shine the brightest in the Committee of States. Partnering you with all, I promise, I promise this to the Honorable Chief Minister, sir. Friends, I see each one of you as an equal partner, equal stakeholder in our collective efforts to deliver best security and safety ecosystem for our citizens. I consider myself very lucky to be a member of this group, this team, which has presence of such illustrious and meritorious officers. Such rich, rich pool of officers is rarely seen in any of the states. I consider myself also lucky that we are working in an ecosystem of a state where our Honorable Chief Minister and the government has given topmost priority to the safety and security of, of people. It has given best dividends by attracting big investments which has led to fast economic development of the state. Police is seen widely as partners in economic development in Telangana. We have to take it to the next high level. Telangana is the engine of growth for entire country, whether it is electricity, encouragement to farmers, or safety for women, children, and weaker section. Even attracting all big companies from the globe it also brings with it the challenges which comes with rapid urbanization. Today is the occasion when our beloved Director General of Police, Sri Mahendra Reddy sir, is debiting office after a long and very eventful tenure. Sri Mahendra Reddy sir, to me, symbolizes many things professionally. First, I would mention uniform systemic response to every situation each time and at all places from the remote area of etu nagram to the it hub of financial district from the remote place of eagle penta to the swanky campus of madapur our response mechanism has to be uniform and something 
which offers a sense of delight to the citizens we serve. This process has to be continuously improved and improved every day by day. Sri Mahendra Reddy sir also symbolizes use of technology to take policing to the doorstep of every citizen and in the process empowering every citizen. It is the most fundamental right of every citizen to demand safety and security with dignity and self-respect. When we empower citizens, we empower the effort of policing. As every citizen is a cop and every cop is a citizen. A better sense of transparency and objectivity by building systemic architecture for every vertical of police ecosystem has been the hallmark of Sri Mahinda Repi. This requires constant and very close watch <coughs> by each one, of, each one of us on a daily basis. It would be my prime duty to, to take all these initiatives to greater heights. Sir, I promise you that together we all will work hard to fulfill your dreams so that next generation of citizens who are growing feel proud of their legacy. My best tribute to Sri Mahendra Reddy sir will be my sincere effort to carry forward all the good initiatives started by him. I consider myself privileged to have worked directly under him as his additional commissioner of police law and order in Hyderabad city, as additional director general of police law and order in the state. This has enabled me to observe him and imbibe his work ethos. The vision of our Honorable Chief Minister, sir, which stands tall as the Integrated Command and Control Center and the Commissioner of Police Office at Banjarahi, has many emotional attachments for both Mahinda Reddy, sir, and me. As his additional CP Law and Order, I remember the first day of the discussion when Honorable CM, sir, mentioned why just 16 floors, make it 24. It was not an issue of adding few floors but it was the strong intent and the highest priority which government was indicating by this building. The Honorable CM was conveying across that this has to be of the tallest standard in the country. I consider it my privilege to have attended more than 400 meetings at every stage for the development of this integrated command and control center. वन सिटी डेवलपर्स की एक और शानदार पेशकश जहांगीर पीर दरगाह से दो किलोमीटर पहले आबादी के बीचों बीच गांव से लगा हुआ वेंचर फीगस सिर्फ पांच हजार रूपए नकद या आसान अक्सात पर नेटको फार्मा पीएनजी जॉनसन एंड जॉनसन एलवी प्रसाद आई हॉस्पिटल कंपनीज के करीब गेटेड कम्युनिटी वाटर इलेक्ट्रिसिटी ट्रांसपोर्ट की सहूलत मुकम्मल सिक्योरिटी और सेफ्टी के साथ फौरी मुलाकात करें वन सिटी डेवलपर्स ऑफिस एड्रेस बिसाइड चॉइस फंक्शन हॉल चंद्रयान गुट्टा हैदराबाद फॉर फर्दर डिटेल्स कॉन्टैक्ट नाइन